Alright guys, tonight's game is going to be Spear and Shield traveling to England to play Castle of Water at Castle Park. Um, obviously the opening game of the season for both these teams. Castle of Water coming off of a pretty average season. Five wins, five losses, and ten draws. So, didn't make the playoffs, surprisingly. They were expected to be a top four team last season, but they just, I don't know, for whatever reason, they couldn't solve things their problems and they just kept conceding stupid goals and couldn't get the goals when they needed them and they are trying to build back up to being a prestige prestigious club now spear and shield this is just their second season in existence so last season was their first season they did okay captained by the great scott kane and net the greatest goalie in league history um, they're a team based in greece so uh... they're looking to try and get into the playoffs this season. They didn't make it last season, so neither of these teams made the playoffs last season. Both will be trying very hard to get there and start building up their clubs the way they want. Castle of Water were once one of the top teams in the league. Never won a cup, but they have usually been pretty good. Spear and Shield want to be a good team. So here we go. Let's get it kicked off. We're at Castle Park in England. It's a uh, I want to bring you guys some more different teams here as we kick off the season so you can get a look at some other teams. Let me just plug in my controller. It's a rainy night here at Castle Park. Cold night. There's Buffon leading out Castle Water and Scott Kane leading out. Both teams captained by their goalie. And these fans expect more from Arsene Wenger's team this season, Castle of Water. Certainly the favorites in this one. I'm playing as um, a Spear and Shield guys, just so you know. Peter will be controlling Castle of Water. There they are. Kane and Rooney up front. Hazard inside. Willie Santana sitting in behind. Spear and Shield going with their five man defense as, usual, as they did last season. Kane and Net. The right back, Voris, the young Greek man over there. Uh, Lacazette up top as they really struggled to score goals. One of the worst offensive teams last season was Spear and Shield. Uh, here we go. Koopman with it. Both these teams do like to possess. Ziola sends strong and he's called for the challenge. So in the heavy rain, there's a heavy challenge straight off the bat. Look at Ziolas going in on Danny Rose. New signing for uh, Castle of Water to give them a little bit of youth in the back line. Way by Julie Ertz. There's Koopman. Spins it outside Rose again. Stones and Renakia now anchoring the back line. And the veteran Matt Cullity, always reliable over there. Here's Rooney. Chamberlain. Hoping for a big season from him. Apatopoulos just gets rid of that. Anywhere will do. Spear and Shield are usually pretty tough to break down. Of course, they got Kane and Net. They play a very defensive system. Check a Greek team would. Lacazette uh, in. Ziolas. Respect Fazidis. Turns it over in a bad spot. Kane. Manolas had to cover that one as he was looking for Rooney. Bad turnover from Fazidis. Interested to see this Vorus player. I don't really know anything about him, but we can sign him. Right back position. Hazard, who had a very weak season last campaign. He was almost traded at the transfer deadline. They really need him to bounce back here. Matt Cullity. It's John Hawk goes around him. Still Matt Cullity. It's not away. <laughs> Spear and Shield living very dangerously. Now Fet Fazidis. That's going to go through him. Pushed off it by Willie Santana. There's just nobody up there for Spear and Shield. Koopman. 
turns it over. Epizidis needs an outlet. Jermaine Jones, the American, swing it wide to John Hogg. Hair and all. This team has great hair. Shahan and John Hogg. Jermaine Jones, of course. Harry Kane. Rooney. And goodbye. Very nervy start from Spear and Shield on the road. You got to do this. You give it away again. That one deflected and right to the hands of Scott Kane. It's a very nervy Spear and Shield. Can't really hold on to the ball. Turning it over in bad spots. Lacazette. Again, they just can't connect on anything right now. Got to get a hold of this ball and get some of the sting out of the game. I nice send Ziolas. Good for Lacazette, but John Stones is there. Rooney again. There's a lot of bodies back there, so it's going to be tough for Castle Water to continuously pull through. Now Voros, the young Greekman. They're going to try and build him up. He's going to be starting right away, surprisingly, for this team. Hurts. Adopolis. This is what Castle, uh, sorry, Spear and Shield do a lot of is possess it in the back in the middle third. It's when they get to that final third, they just can't find a pass for the numbers. In this part of the park, though, they're very good. They will frustrate you at times with their possession. These fans are going to do a lot of whistling. Shahan. Lacazette. Some movement here. Spins away Lacazette. But the Zetas could never get on the end of that one. Ziolas. Jones, his shot. Steam down. Rooney, dispossessed by Jermaine Jones, the workhorse. Castle Water finally starting to settle in a bit here. The early Castle Siege. But Zetas, Lacazette. Dropping those little pockets now. They really struggled to find a star forward. They have some decent strikers on the team, but none that really produced goals. And they started probably about five or six different strikers last season at least. Shahan, the Turkish international. Shahan, what a ball from Fetfazidis. Lacazette calls for it. Nods it down. Oh, deflected and it goes out of bounds. They throw it. Great play there from Shahan and Fetfazidis. Boros, close down. Chamberlain, Oxley Chamberlain. Over the top, but tracking all the way is John Hogg, and he'll get it back to Kane, who's easily the best goalie in the league with his feet. That's the water starting to knock it around here in the rain. John Hogg, a very steady player in the back. Oh, that one nearly turned over in a bad spot. And in fact, it was. Horrible for Papadopoulos. He's tried to pass it back to Kane. It's a corner kick. Harry Kane's there, and the meat and drink. Scott Kane. We got Kane up. We'll get back to him in just a second, because here comes Wayne Rooney. For Harry Kane, but it's too far, and Scott Kane will out there and pick it up. He's been busy. Scott Kane, who won a cup in the very first season of the league's existence with Xbox Soccer, and then also won twice with the Independence. So he's a three-time champion there in that. He's looking to build up a championship team here in Greece. Shahan, Boros, Ziolas, Jermaine Jones. Again, the fans frustrated with the 
Uh, so, I mean, uh, Spear and Shield, who are not a very fancy, exciting team to watch, i got to be honest, guys. They're pretty much a blue-collar blue workhorse kind of team. They will play slow pace. Just like this. Just probing for the openings, no rushes. Steven Weber, the manager of this team. Wants them to be methodical. Violas, now Lacazette, there's the opening. Patience is a virtue as Bazidis is through again. Shahan, wow. What a horrible header. Went backwards somehow. Absolutely skipped off his head in the rain. Just needs to do way better there. What a tackle from Jermaine Jones. And uh, players down here. I don't know who it is. Let's kick it out. Even though the computer won't give it back to me. But uh, No injury on the play, so they're okay. Castle of Water will not give it back. We'll win it back anyways. That's something I wish the... Uh, Pez would integrate into their team, into the game. And I don't know if it's in the new one or not. Is if a player is down injured and you kick it out of bounds, not that they would know you're doing it on purpose, though. To just give it back, but I guess there's really no way of them knowing that you're actually doing it on purpose. Ten minutes from halftime, and no score here. Castle of Water have had their chances. Experience Shield just had a glorious chance. Shahan muffed the header badly. Shahan. Still, look, there's just no options going forward. Jones turns it over. Rooney. No way through for Rooney. That defense there collapsing. Boris has looked pretty steady over there in his debut, the youngster. Though he is surrounded with some good veterans in there. Manolis, Julie Ertz, John Hogg, Jermaine Jones, Scott Kane, of course. So He is the young legs in the lineup, that's for sure. Violas, neat and tidy here. Ertz, Lacazette. Zetas snuffed out by Hazard. That's a water can repossess. It's closed down again. That spear and shield defense starting to lock all windows and doors. Boris this time getting in there. Spirit Shield were not an easy team to beat last season. They only won, I think, five games, but they, I think they lost six or seven and tied the rest of them. They just, again, their problem was just scoring goals. And a lot of times they would give up a goal or two and that would be it. They could either tie or lose. They would. Just Lacazette taken out, no call. They continue here, Lacazette does well to escape trouble. That's been, and that's it for the first half. Not much to write home about there. Swift Zetas in the rain. Definitely uh, Stephen Weber will be the happier of the two coaches. Arsene Wenger will not be pleased with how his team attacked. Possession all spear and shield, but that possession was not really going anywhere. But the, it's the way they play, and, and now it's working. Do we make any changes here? Options for Spear and Shield. We have Kone, and Brian Ruiz, new signing Itu, uh, Taxitas, Sergio Roberto, Petunius. Decent options. This Castle Water will have. We have some options off the bench as well. Julio Baptista, Jermaine Defoe, 
Danny Wallback, Alan Wake. Second half's underway, no changes for either side. And if you're Arsene Wenger's team, Castle Water, you got to show a little more attacking intent this half to get this home crowd into it because this is looking a lot like the way Castle Water played last season. Some fans even calling for Arsene Wenger to be fired, especially since they didn't even make the playoffs when they were very much expected to. It's going to be tough for them to get back in there, I'll tell you. Teams that did make it last season in Group B certainly haven't gotten any weaker. Peanut Butter Pirates look stronger. That's hot. Look like they're going to have a stronger team. We haven't seen them play yet, but we'll see. Obviously, Adidas, Dimension X, we invented Lightning, Philly, the OC will all be up there. A team like Spear and Shield is going to find it very difficult to get in. But you never know. There's a lot of parity in this league, which I like, but again, sometimes those big clubs tough to knock off. The work. Jermaine Jones charging forward. He's got Lacazette who drifted off sides. Wins a corner. And we're going to be swung in here by Fetfazidis. Body's in there. Voros. Oh, he fell to the young Greekman. He rushed it on his left foot. Couldn't believe he found the ball, I think. He's looking to score in his debut. And his eyes lit up there for a second. Long by Buffon. And Spear and Shield will set up shop once again. Castle of Water chasing shadows lately. Boros has had an amazing game for the young Greek men. I like this player. Yeah. Jones, Jermaine Jones. John Hogg. Zeolis. Lily Santana trying to put on pressure here. Fans whistling and booing. They can do that all they want. Doesn't bother Spear and Shield at all. Lacazette. Shahan. is a step on Cullody. Ross is blocked. And another corner coming up. Spear and Shield. So they're starting to find some joy. And that left side. Whipped in there towards Julie Ertz. But she can't get her head on it. Now Rooney, Harry Kane, goes around Manolas. Kane needs some help. He does have a player charging forward. He never gets it to him. I don't know who that, I think that was Chamberlain that was busting down the other side. This is dangerous though, this is very dangerous. Wayne Rooney's in and he scores. Wayne Rooney. Uh, that's from Harry Kane, I believe. Just a little slip pass, and he was in. He was onside, and no chance for Scott Kane to save that one. I mean, look at this. Just a little slip pass. Rooney's in. Easy one-touch finish there. Spear and shield. Finally broken down there, and now where do they get the goal? I mean, Rooney, though. Basically, Rooney and Kane were the only ones providing any offense last season for this team, and they're at it again. They need more from the midfield. Hazard, Chamberlain, really Santana. This is not what Spear and Shield want to be chasing a game. Hazard. Oh, Voris goes in and takes him out. And Jones goes in. Jermaine Jones again. Surging for Jermaine Jones. Oh, 
comes off the crossbar and where the post meet. And the cross is not handsome at all. But what a what a charge by Jermaine Jones and he flashed one and nearly found the upper corner. What a goal that would have been. Koopman. Santana dispossessed. Shahan keeps it in. Castlewater defense is pretty good still. They've been one of the more reliable defensive units the last several seasons. Of course, with Buffon in net. And just the system that they're playing here seems to suit them. Three points will go a big way for Castlewater to open the season, give them a confidence boost. As they look to restake their claim as a formidable contender. Kane is possessed by Manolas. And can't find Fetvizidis as Rose tracks back. Now it's Castle of Water bossing the ball. So Shahan gets it back. Jones working ever so hard in there to win everything he can. What a game Jermaine Jones has had. He's trying to get the goal. Here he goes again. Hit Fazidis. Trying to do some moves too much. Boras has played well as too. There's not a lot of creativity for this team. That's the, that's the biggest issues here. They don't have like a big time finisher up there. Lacazette gets the nod up here, but he needs to start putting the ball in the net. Tracking back from Ziolis. All right, we got to make some changes here. We're going to bring, bring on Christian Atsu. Kone will come in as well. We're going to push him up a little bit. Jones drop right there. See if we can get Kone, Fetfazidis linking up Lacazette. I don't know, do I want to give Lacazette more time? They have the new striker, the Japanese man Ito in there. I'm going to try him. Ryan Ruiz and Gomez as well. Not sure. Lacazette's movement's been pretty good, so we'll leave him in for now. Julie Ertz, also known as Julie Johnston, of course. Oh, there's a foul. On Harry Kane, he's going to get booked. Just shoved away, Boris. Here come the subs. So, Atsu, who started a lot of games last season, comes in. Kone was very much kind of a super sub. One thing I've noticed this team hasn't done and a lot of other teams have done against me in these streams so far is Castle Water don't seem to play the long ball too often. They try and play on the ground and work it down the sides. Other teams kept playing these long passes over the top. I think it's because of the style that I have them set up to play. Kone. Spear and Shield can't afford to be too patient here. Here's Kone. I believe uh, is the score of the first ever goal in the franchise's history. Kone, last season. He's got that little 
achievement. Hoping for another one here. Tor Voris, good tracking. Again, Voris deals with it well and spins away. This guy, this kid, I should say, he's good. Man, I never knew who this guy was. I was just looking at, I was scouting young Greek players for them to sign. Realized they needed another right back on the roster. And I saw his name. Plays for Olympiakos, I think, or Panathiakos, one of those Greek teams. And they're going to give him a start here. He's, he's pretty solid in this one. Voros. How old he is in real life now? He's probably like 23, which is still young for soccer players. Oh, Rooney's in again, and he scores. I don't know how they didn't get that away. Rooney's got a brace. How do they not get that away? Just giving up some bad goals. Here are uh, Spear and Shield. 2-0, and it's looking like the full three points are going to be going, staying right here. It's party time at Castle Park. Wayne Rooney. Uh, what happened here? Kane. Rooney's got it. He's got it. There was one there initially, but then Rooney just ran in and got it. Couldn't clear it. Like you win possession, but the ball skips too far off your player's foot. And, oh, that's going to be all she wrote here. No way does Spear and Shield get two goals here. Kone. Not even close. Not been a sexy effort here on the offensive end. Let's uh, get him out and bring in, bring in Brian Ruiz, I guess. Costa Rican going to come in. Castle Water are going to open up with a nice win and keep pace with. Adidas, we invented lightning in Dimension X early on at least. So far in Group A, we've seen some ties. A uh, game or two have been played off stream as well. Dolphin Cove, Girls Gone Wild played off, off camera. My team played off camera actually. One, two, nothing. They will be bringing you. You guys will probably see at least something from every team this season. Uh, some teams you might see every single one of their games. And again, anybody watching this, if you guys want to see more of either of these teams, just let me know. And you'll certainly get more from these teams. If you're like interested in following their season. Because I know a lot of fans that uh, follow leagues will obviously pick a team in each league to follow. No matter what country it is. You know, and if you have a follow in this league later on or you start with me now or whatever. And there's a team in this league that you think you want to follow, want to see more of, I'll be glad to play all their games on stream video here's Brian Ruiz now oh it's a good hit a good save for Buffon they're looking for a consolation goal Buffon says come on let's get this clean sheet now Atsu towards Ertz you can't win it Hazard a quiet game for Hazard but Rooney has done the trick. 
I don't think they've made any subs. Ertz. Very good sound performance from Castle of Water in that second half, and that's it. Julie Ertz and Papadopoulos yelling at each other. 2 nothing, Castle of Water. Possession still in favor of Spear and Shield, but created very little. I mean, neither team created a lot going forward. Castle Water pretty much just took their chances. Spear and Shield open up their home stand, their or, uh, home schedule next next uh, game against Haunting Evidence. That's a game they very much would look at, like to win. Castle Water go on the road to take on FC Plymouth. That's a pretty good matchup there. Big. That's a big game for both teams, I'd say to stake their claim as contenders, Castle of Water and FC Plymouth. Plymouth have yet to open up their season, so. Let's just take a look at the ratings, guys, and I'll sign off. Wayne Rooney, the man of the match, no doubt about it. So there you have it, guys. Thank you so much for joining me again. Hope you're enjoying more of this uh, league so far. Pez, and plenty more to come. Uh, appreciate you watching. So until next time. Zero is the number.